I feel like a failure. I feel really horrible. <music> Everybody. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello. My name is Takaija, and this channel is all about randomness, craziness, and fun. If you're returning, thank y'all so much. We were on a journey to 10,000 subscribers, but we are well past that. So now we're on a new journey to 100,000 subscribers. So stay subscribed, and thank you so much for being part of my crew. My lips are mad dry. This video is brought to you in partnership with Darn Good Yarn. They are a sustainable clothing brand. They make t-shirts, scarves, jewelry, everything from reused and recycled material. I'm gonna show you this mock that they sent me and it's made from old saris. And if you don't know what a sari is, I'll insert a picture, but it is a traditional Indian garb. So let me show you my outfit really quick. But look at this cute, little number it's actually and you guys know i'm tall i'm five eight and a half five nine and it sits like pretty well i have on black shorts underneath it just in case i bend over but today i'm getting my hair done and my makeup done so i'm gonna wear this like as my lounge outfit i really love the detail i love this purple and green it's not too tight i think i got their biggest size but it is really really comfortable and i really love the material and you can just tell it was made with love and with a conscious mind so if you're interested let me tell you how you can buy one you can either buy this mock that i have on or you can buy some of their jewelry they have other skirts and things like that really cute wrap skirts you can use my code to 15 to go to their site their site link will also be in the description below as well as my code you can go to their site shop with my discount and the discount is good until march 31st 2021 so make sure y'all take advantage of that okay now let's get into this video so y'all i'm not going to uh do too much of an intro because i'm inserting some cell phone footage from the other day i kind of recorded um how i was feeling in that moment and i'm also going to be doing my face routine as i talk i recorded how i was feeling in that moment um because it was really really hard okay i was not feeling well i just felt like this past week has literally tried me the scar on my cheek from popping a pimple like accurately depicts how i was feeling so i'm trying to be as vulnerable as possible um i did not record a video at all last week because i was not inspired to and i felt like i let everybody down even though probably no one really cares so i just felt really bad and i just felt like you know i'm slacking on my the things i love creating content because of challenges in my life and i really really do not like that you know so i am feeling a lot better today um i have i'm filming some stuff today and i'm really really excited so you know i think this week is going to be a much better week than it was last week i'm actually going to make sure this week is a much better week than last week because my intentions are going to be clear my intentions are going to be purposeful this week and i'm not going to let things i'm going to try my best not to let things get get to me because you know i'm worthy of so much more so with all that said um this next video, like I said, this is present. The video that I'm inserting is from my phone. I was really going through it. That is from the past. I am not feeling that way while I'm filming this, but I just wanted to make sure I'm vulnerable with everybody because at the end of the day, I go through it. You know, we all go through it. And, you know, I pride myself on building a platform that is pure or that is honest and, you know, there's always a light at the end of the tunnel i'm still looking for the light but i know it's there and i'm getting closer to it so you know i want to make sure i stay as vulnerable with you all because i know we all go through these similar things so without further ado i hope you enjoyed this video and stay tuned because i have some more heat coming for y'all i promise march is going to be lit on this channel all right tap in bye hey everybody so I'm recording this video. I'm sitting in the CVS parking lot because I need to pick up some things, but I, um, I'm not doing well. Um, I haven't told anybody I'm not doing well. I've only told one person.
how I'm truly doing, like, as far as all the details. And I told my friends Jasmine and Philip I've been really stressed, but um, this video is going to be kind of a stream of consciousness, and I'm hoping to look back at it when I'm feeling much better. Um, and I just want to be vulnerable. I'm still figuring out in my head, like, if this is just going to be for me or for YouTube. <laughs> Um, I've been feeling a whole bunch of things. I'm actually on my phone. Um, I feel like a failure. I feel really horrible about myself. And by no means am I a fan of a pity party. And that's not what this is. It's more so I'm disgusted with myself right now. Um, and more so disgusted because I don't like how I look. I'm breaking out. Um, trying to work out, but just haven't been consistent, haven't been eating the best. I'm disgusted with myself because of some of the life, the choices I've made in life and have hurt people with my choices. I'm disgusted with myself because I can't do for my family like I really want to. I've just made really bad decisions in life in general. And I'm disappointed in myself. And I'm I'm usually the type to like continue on. And I think all this is coupled with stress from work. My job is really intense all of a sudden. It's like it's switched overnight. And while I can high I can handle high intensity, high pressure environments, um there's just a lot going on and like a lot riding on my shoulders. And everything's hitting me at once. And I don't know why I'm being tested like this. And today in particular, I, I've been crying all day. I have boogers in my nose. I have not stopped crying. I cannot stop crying. No, I'm not on my period. So it's not because I'm emotional because of PMS. I'm just extremely just upset with how my life is i'm 29 years old i don't feel like i'm where i should be in general oh, that's a mustache um i just don't have it together like i feel like i should i don't have my even my emotional tact anymore it feels like and I feel so weak and I feel defeated and I just like I just feel so many things and I'm tired my goddamn nails I don't feel pretty like I love doing YouTube but I just feel like it's not going anywhere um just so much shit that I'm going through right now so many thoughts and the reason why I'm not really telling my friends is because I understand that they are going to you know say encouraging things but do I believe them not necessarily so I'm really trying to like work through this by myself and when I tell y'all I've been crying all day I, I don't know if y'all can tell my eyes are swollen they're red the littlest things are setting me off. Um, I want to take my hair down because I feel like a bum. My skin is breaking out really bad. I I have a really big um, thing coming up this weekend that I'm working for, for everybody, for y'all, for me. And I was excited about it, but then all this stuff and all this shit started coming down on me and it just I'm not excited anymore um you know I'm getting my makeup done my hair done and I'm just not feeling like myself um so this video is not I guess made to be like me just ranting about how miserable my life is even though that's exactly how I feel it's more so like I'm fucked up right now and I'm not gonna pretend I'm not um, I feel bad because I haven't released any videos this week. This is like the first week where I've completely skipped. But I just don't feel creative at all. And I just feel like I don't have shit together. I feel horrible. That's the police scanner going off. 
But as I'm talking this out, I actually am feeling a little bit better. Um, these negative thoughts that I have are horrible. I know I think higher of myself than, more highly of myself than I'm speaking. But I'm having a moment. I have these moments often, more often than not since I've turned 29. And I don't know what that's about. So I'm just hoping that I feel better. I'm hoping that I could look back at this video and be like, damn, like you went through it, but you got through it. Like, I'm just hoping that this is like one of those things where it's, I'm just hoping that it's not my karma for bad things, or I'm just hoping that it's a stop in the like, thinking about it just, gives me so much anxiety it literally stops my breath but I'm just hoping that this is like one of those things where it's like okay you have to go through the mud sometimes to get through the good and I'm just hoping that this is just a stop on my journey and I'm hoping that it just doesn't end here y'all like this is gonna sound so weird but today I just wanted someone to like slap the shit out of me or punch me I wanted to feel pain so bad and I've never in my life wanted that before and I didn't know where that came from I don't know if, if I wanted to feel pain to feel alive or to wake me up I don't know but I wanted to feel an immense amount of pain so I just feel like my mental state is really fragile right now and I definitely need to talk to someone um not talking about suicide or anything like that but I just don't feel well and not like sick I don't feel well spiritually mentally physically so i hope i feel better soon and if you've ever dealt with any of these similar feelings i'm praying that you can give me some advice my lips are dry and i look horrible so i'm done bye